Hi, and welcome to the August 9th edition of the CNETL Status Update brought to you by the Barnegat Bay Partnership. Um, my name is Jen, and I'll be giving you the update. This week we didn't see as many nettles as we did last week. Not many at all, actually. Hopefully the worst of them are behind us, but you never know when a new population will pop up. Um, we saw a lot of decreases in our sites, and only two increases, but the increases were very slight. At Shelter Cove in Tom's River, we found 11 nettles this week as compared to four last week, so not a big deal. Uh, and we only found two at Allen Road in Bayville as compared to zero last week, so also not a huge threat there. Um, the rest of our sites, we found decreases in nettles. At La Valette on Brooklyn Ave in the Bay, we found only 32 nettles as compared to over 600 last week. So that was really good to see. We didn't have to count so many nettles. There were no nettles at Berkeley Island Park in Bayville and none on Anglesey Ave in Ocean Gate. Uh, we only found one nettle on the Toms River where the Long Swamp Creek enters the river in Toms River. So that was pretty good because we found 93 nettles there last week. There's only one this week. Um, and our last site, Windward Beach in Brick, we only found 21 nettles this week as compared to almost 1,400 last week. So that was really wonderful <laughs> to see. Um, in addition to that, we also found, we caught some kind of new cool fish that we haven't caught so far this year at Allen Road. There's a, a nice diversity of fish species there. And so this week we found a tautog, a creval jack, a feather blenny, in addition to all the species we normally catch there. So it's pretty cool to see. And that's about it. Thanks, as always, to the townships of Brick and Lavalette for their continued support and cooperation. And thanks to the rest of the municipalities for participating. Have a great week.